good morning class now we are going to read a poem and the name of the poem is mystery of the talking fan mystery of the talking fan is a very short poem written by maude robin maude robin was born on june 30 1891 and he passed away on october 1973 at the age of 82 years He had been residing in Santa Ana Orange Country, California. Some of the books written by him are Leaves of Laurel and Fangs of Midnight. This is all about the poet. So before moving into the poem, do tell me is there a ceiling fan in the room where you are sitting? or is there a ceiling fan in your bedroom is the fan quiet or noisy <clears throat> so this poem the mystery of talking fan is very much relative to a talking fan the poet here acquaints us with a fan which talks a lot he means that the fan makes spontaneous sound on motion or while rotating or while revolving <coughs> let's see the poem mystery of the talking fan once there was a talking fan electrical his chatter i could not quite hear what he said and i hope it doesn't matter because one day somebody oiled is little whirling motor and all the mystery was spoiled he ran as still as water so once there was a talking fan electrical his chatter here chatter means talk or gossip i couldn't quite hear what he said and i hope it doesn't matter because one day somebody oiled his little whirling motor whirling means revolve and all the mystery was spoiled here mystery means puzzle and he ran it ran as still as water so the poet is saying that once there was an electric fan which makes lot of noise so that fan made lot of noise the poet could not make out what was wrong with the fan the poet tries to hear what the fan says but he fails to understand one day he called an electrician and the electrician put oil in the noisy fan or in the talking fan as a result suddenly the fan stopped making noise the fan became noiseless movement became smooth the movement was silent so the mystery that the fan was dissolved demanding was solved okay so through this poem the poet is saying that there was a talking fan or there was an electric fan which made lots of noise and the poet always fails to understand what the fan is saying and one day he called an electrician and the electrician puts oil in the noisy fan and as a result the fan became noise noiseless and all the problems were solved okay so this is all about the poem thank you